is up guys it's chewy here and i'm back with the true news video um some of this info isn't really that great because i completely messed up on making the actual video but most of this is pretty recent i did update it so then i wasn't giving out like last week's video um originally i was gonna have zoe burgers in one of them or at least uh some info about it and i did a pretty funny little sketch but it's old news now so I, i'm not gonna do it so i have to be more on the ball game also i just wanted to tell you guys i don't post as often is because i don't take youtube as seriously but um I, that doesn't mean unsubscribe. I'm still going to post and all that good stuff. I do care about my fans and stuff like that. So show some support and stuff like that. But I'm not going to post as often because I get really busy and stuff like that. As I've already told you guys in the previous videos, I'm trying really hard right now. I'm thinking about doing another gameplay video. And I'm completely sorry about the people that are waiting for the Super Smash Bros. I'm really trying to figure out uh, some stuff for it. But other than that, let's get right into the Chewy News video. Our first story isn't that much drama, but more towards entertaining. So if you follow Scarce on Twitter, you probably know the situation. <laughs> Alright, sorry, like uh, I, I kind of choked right there on uh, my own uh, breath. I'm kind of sick, even though it doesn't sound like that. Alright, so if you follow Scares, uh, you probably already know about how another girl almost rear-ended uh, rear him while he was driving. Um, obviously, it wasn't really Scares' fault. The lady was being a very bad driver. Um, so, this was last week, and I'm sorry if uh, you guys already read this, and you guys are like, oh, that's that story that he's probably talking about. But just in case you um, missed the tweet, then I, I decided to tell you guys. Um, for our second story, it is about two YouTubers that won't stop roasting each other in their videos. Honestly, sometimes it's kind of dumb. Uh, the comment section isn't meant for two YouTubers to go fighting over the quality of their video or audio. That's what Titter... Twitter. Twitter or Facebook is for dub. They're actually in uh, friends in real life, so I don't know why they're hating on each other. They should be more towards helping each other out. The two YouTubers are Epic Twit25 and Gamer563. And I also know them myself because I'm friends with them. We live in the same area and we go to the same school. Honestly, it just needs to stop, especially if you guys are friends. At least that's my opinion. One day you might take it too far, and then you guys are going to completely hate each other for real. I actually am going to be interviewing Gamer563 uh, in next week's video for Chewing News. Um, or I'll, I, I don't know, because I'm, I noticed, I realized something, that Chewing News was very good when I posted it originally, and I didn't have no clue why I stopped that series, and my videos do average around the same type of views, except some of them are doing good, and I also noticed my tutorial video did pretty good on views, so I'm thinking about doing another one soon, but I still want to get that Super Smash out before I do anything else, because I feel bad for you other, you, you other viewers, and I'm sorry if I stutter a lot, Doing this audio stuff really makes your mouth dry, and I'm still in school, and I'm just doing this because, well, it's basically break time for us, and we don't have to do anything, so I'm just sitting in a room all by myself, and this is in the same room. It's a, it's a practice room. It's in band, so don't get all crazy like ditching class, Chewy. So anyways... For our third story, it is more about Gamer563. Recently, he beat another team in Roblox mode. Or, not in a Roblox mode, but it's like in a, Momo a Roblox game. And there's different game modes like TDM and stuff like that. At least that's what I'm pretty sure he said to me. And Gamer563 and his team completely demolished Potato Squad. That was the team that he faced. So now... The so-called Potato Squad has been smashing the dislike button on his videos. And I kind of feel bad for him because he, he, I know he does the same videos over it, but some people do get entertained by that, especially the youngsters and all that good stuff. So, I mean, why are you going to do that? Especially, it, it's just rude. Like, that needs to stop. For our final story, it's about a YouTuber named JayStation. He is a YouTuber that does 24-hour challenges. Well, he made it on the news, not yesterday, it was like two days or three days ago. He lives in Ohio, uh, or not Ohio, I'm sorry for that. 
Ottawa, and so obviously it hasn't came to us quite yet. It probably won't. But all these 24-hour challenges, YouTubers might start getting investigating suit too, not just him. So I say good luck to you guys. Please check out Jay Station. I really like his channel, and in my personal opinion, he's a good YouTuber. I really hope he doesn't go to jail or so anything else. It was his fault, but he's a really good guy in the end. He doesn't steal stuff when he he did a 24-hour challenge in the mall. You know how much stuff he could have stole? And the security there was bad. They didn't find him until like six hours later when he was laying down on a bed for a furniture story. So that was pretty stupid of him. But, I mean, it's what happens. I guess it's karma or whatever you would like to call it. Whatever you believe in. Um, if you're coming from my channel, say Chewy knew, uh, or Chewy Sysak sent you in his comments, maybe I'll get some publicity by him. At least that's what I'm hoping. And I'm hoping I could furthermore get better in the Chewy News, so all good stuff. So, yeah. And, um, I don't know uh, if Scarce ever did this. I've watched some of his videos, but he, from what I've seen of, he didn't do anything about this. So, go into his, uh, comments and, like, spam him talking about J Station and all these other 25-hour YouTubers. Because, honestly, they need some more publicity. And uh, that's it for this video, guys. Please hit that like button. Let's get 10 likes on this video. Subscribe if you're new. Like my little outro to where you can click on either ways. The left side will send you to a random video from my channel. And if you haven't seen my first Chewy News, then click the right one. It's okay if you're on mobile. Links are in the description. So, yeah, guys.